So that's Shama. The point here is that if Mrs. if the Gandhis have nothing to do with this, that they want this entire process to be transparent and they are being neutral in this exercise, then why aren't they coming out and saying so? Because there is enough indication the palace intrigue is only building, that the fog is only getting thicker. I don't understand what you mean by that. I think Mr. Mistry has made it clear. I don't think uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi comes out and says everything. There are people who speak on their behalf. And I think Mr. Mistry said very clearly that there is no official candidate. And I recall three to four days back, even Mr. Jairam Ramesh has said the same thing, that there is no official candidate. And I also recall that when some spokesperson said something against Dr. Tharoor, there was an official uh, statement from our party saying that nobody is supposed to speak against anyone or any delegate who wants to be a candidate because this is a free and fair elections. We were, our own party people were pulled up for speaking against, I think, Dr. Tharoor. So this is the kind of democracy we have. So that came from the top, from Mrs. Gandhi itself, that she, she wants this to be a very free and fair election. And nobody is supposed to speak against a particular delegate, a particular contestant, for example, Dr. Tharoor. So, I mean, that itself shows, Maria, that no official candidate from the party is there. It is each one's right. They have a right to have any proposal then they want to have. Then why are Rashid, I mean, Nirjah have, and Sanjay uh, Kumar and all of us thinking, seeing this image? Just look at this image that has come from the Congress headquarters. That's what? This is being seen as official candidate. And Rashid, why are you seeing this, seeing Mr. Kharge as an official candidate then? So, can I answer, can I, I give you the answer for that? Yes, um, please, uh, Rashid Maria. will be able so to why respond. why do I feel, why Rashid do I will feel, respond, yes. no, no, can I just respond with one, one liner? Okay. Why do I feel and the rest of India feels J.P. Nadda is a, is a rubber stamp of Mr. Modi and Amit Shah? Okay, Rashid. Th th so, what about that? I mean, I know that he's a rubber stamp, so, Rashid, you, it was, your assumptions was there some are kind of vicious. tactical retreat? It's a democracy. Uh, uh, yes, uh, Tuhin, first you respond to that and then I bring in Rashid. Yes. You know, it's, what it's very amusing to see the it's Congress. The Why didn't you elect? You know, give, give Why have you taken Nitin Gadkari out of the parliamentary party? No, no, let me board. answer. You Can can't you answer go that? on and on. Why did you take out Mr. You know, it's very out amusing. of the parliamentary party board? Okay, Shivan now Shikh please Shohan keep quiet and have the patience to hear. Why? Please yeah. answer You know, those it's questions. very amusing to see the Congress wax eloquent on democracy. The Congress... If you read the Congress Constitution, Article 19 of the Constitution mandates that 20 out of 23 CWC members, 12 have to be elected. Can she name 12 elected members of CWC? You don't follow democracy at all. Forget, I'm giving you a small I example. Want you, I dare you July, to elect your president. Group. Allow me to complete, please. I dare have the basic you to elect policy. your president. In 2017, to me, where, why haven't you elected the in president? In 2017, the district... Allow me to complete my point on yes, barge yes, like yes. this. So have the basic it. But you're not ask, answering in the question. Have an election. Yes. In 2017, you're not answering the question. You can't Congress just keep going on blabbering. What? Okay. No, no, what question? But why? you have Whether to answer to why there is no election, election in your party. Shama, you have made your point. Is there? No Shama, you have made your point. Shama, you have made your point. Listen to party member. Okay. The I mere just point, time. The, no, yes. no, please allow me to complete this. Okay. The Congress behavior okay. of barging okay. in, okay. I'll, allow, okay. I'll, answer, okay. I'll answer all the questions. Whether ah. our president, hmm. whether our president is nominated or elected, you know, should have nothing to, the Congress should have nothing to do with it. But fact is that at the end of the day, all of them have delivered for the party. And at the end of the day, all of them have enjoyed unanimous support of the party. That's point number one. Point number two, you talk about democracy so in 2017. No, no I'm giving business you a small questioning example us. the grassroots. I'm giving you a small you example. You have no business a, a, questioning a us, Kareem. The district president of the Congress very we affectionately don't want to hear your referred small to Rahul Gandhi as Papuji on a WhatsApp chat with of his party. He was immediately sacked from his party. So forget teach, giving us sermons I'm of sorry, democracy. You can't even name the twelve elected Tuhin, when, when CWC are members, when your which are leaders are questioned. Action mandate. is taken also against them. So let's not, you know, try and find difference here. When. Is such such act of indiscipline so they, is, is done by your, against your party, the way then you also take action. So let's not the, go down the, the path, please. The way they are giving sermons on Nirja, democracy Nirja, doesn't Nirja, behove the Nirja, Congress party. That's all Nirja, I'm saying. Uh, as far as, uh, you know, something really changed in the last 24 hours. Uh, last evening, it was Digvijay Singh versus Shashi Tharoor. Uh, we had broken here that Mr. Kharge will be the surprise wild card entry. But we really do not sense that it will be leading to an exit of Mr. Digvijay Singh. It is very clear that Digvijay Singh did not have the backing of the Gandhis. 
Will this be seen as tactical retreat on his part? Yeah, I think so, because he may have hoped with the exit of Mr. Ashok, Ashok Gehlot, there was a possibility that the Gandhis might back his candidature. Uh, and uh, he talked about throwing his hat in the ring. But once it was clear that it was going to be Mr. Kharge, then obviously the perception is that Mr. Kharge is really the candidate of the Gandhis, backed by the Gandhis, no matter what Mr. Mistri says. One thing I want to say, hmm. uh, one more thing I want to say, hmm. and that is, you know, that there is a growing aversion in the country against entitlement, whether it's political entitlement, bureaucratic entitlement, the, and the BJP has very systematically pushed Rahul Gandhi in the corner as Papu, of course, as prince, of course, but really as a symbol of political entitlement. And that is one of the reasons why he's, he, you know, that he's not had the kind of traction that he had hoped for. Now, why the Gandhi, why non-Gandhi to be a president? I think it is that, that your fight, if there is, it's not only the BJP that's saying Congress Muk Bharat or a Gandhi family Muk Congress, it's, it, that idea is resonating in the country. And I think the Gandhi family has to take note of that. I mean, I hope Mr. Kharge is not going to be the image we remember, I remember of Mr. Motilal Vora running behind you, uh, yes. Sonia Gandhi and Rahul Gandhi. I hope he will have greater authority. dignity. authority, autonomy. Yes. Okay, I have just enough time for Rashid Kidwai and his final words. Rashid, um, you know, will this really lead to that massive transformation or image building exercise that the Congress is looking at? You know, and particularly that we are looking at an 80 year old uh, who will be given the task of rejuvenating carders. Will they be enthused? I think far from it, it's not at all. If you look at Mr. Karge's track record in Punjab earlier, where he was said to be, you know, responsible for propping up uh, Charanji Singh Channi as chief minister and in what happened in Jaipur where he had gone an observer and he remained a you know, mute spectator of uh, uh, you know, the mockery that was made about CLP uh, uh, leadership, etc. I think that's where Gandhis have a chance. And Maria, I don't agree with all other panelists who are uh, presenting other than Shama a very dismal picture. I think Gandhis have a good... Today was the last day of filing nominations. Tomorrow is another day. From tomorrow, electioning starts. And if Gandhi is so, and you know, make a very public pronouncement that they are not party to either this candidate or that candidate, I think it would show them in, in a much better light. Okay, so you are of the opinion that this intrigue should end and that they should publicly come and announce so. Rashid? Absolutely. Right. And announce so and allow this because if the party is in, you know, going down, let there be some kind of messaging. I mean, I'm just saying a very a kind of uh, utopian Yeah, scenario. but it's done through Mr. Mistri. Mr. Mistri is in charge. The Mr. Mistri said what they want to say. That's why Mr. Mistri has said that, Mr. All right, Kidwai. Dr. Shama Mohammed, Please try to Rashid understand. Kidwai, Nija, we don't Chaudhary, need to come and, and give a... Kumar, Tuhin Sina, thank you so much for joining us. We're slipping into a 